It seems hard to believe the woman who had embodied a kingdom is gone. It's like a mother or grandmother passing. Uh, she was that significant to the British people. She was the British people. Dr. Matthew Roberts, a British citizen living in Denver, sums up the feeling of so many like him who grew up during the reign of Queen Elizabeth II. My mom went to the coronation and we had all kinds of coronation memorabilia around the house. Judy Ullman remains British, living in Greenwood Village. She grew up in the north of England, remembering at age three how her mother went to London to see Elizabeth installed. Ullman has always respected how the young queen took an ordinary job earlier in the military. She had a strong sense of duty. Um, and so she took that role really seriously and she really cared about the people and they could feel that. Throughout the years, the monarchy has been called into question in Britain as an unnecessary expense and a relic of the past. But Dr. Roberts says with the Queen now passing and Prince Charles taking over as king, now is not the time for such discussions. Queen and the royal family have been taken back into the hearts of the people, I think, if they were perhaps drifting away in the past. For 70 years, she has been queen. At age 96, she has passed, but still somehow, it seems like a shock. Prince Charles has been waiting in the wings for seven decades, you might say as an apprentice. He now becomes King Charles III. Rick Salinger, covering Colorado First.